President Kerwin introduced American University's new Director of Athletics and Recreation, Billy Walker, at a press conference in Bender Arena. Here's a look. In search for a new Director of Athletics and Recreation at American University, I asked the committee to find me somebody capable of leading a very, very strong department. That is our Department of Athletics and Recreation. In Dr. William Walker, we have found such an individual. And I'm both pleased and proud to welcome him today as our Director of Athletics and Recreation. First, I'd like to uh, say that I'm tremendously humbled to be standing here before you today, having been named as the 14th Director of Athletics and Recreation at American University. It's, it's quite an honor. I had a, several assignments flying helicopters for the Air Force in different uh, parts of the country, um, either as a rescue pilot or here in D.C. as a, um, as a pilot at, at the first helicopter squadron where we flew a lot of dignitaries around. It was a fantastic assignment, you know, flying, flying through D.C. You know, I'm sure those of you in the area see those blue and white helicopters going up and down the river, um, you know, at 100 feet off the river all the time, and uh, that, was, that, that never got old. I wanted to come to an in institution that had the same values that I have, and that puts that primacy on academics, while at the same time um, understands the importance of athletics, understands uh, the importance to support it, and is committed to winning as well, um, but not at the expense of academics. I c can't tell you how excited I was when I uh, got the call from President Kerwin that he, that he wanted me to accept the position, and uh, you know, I wanted to jump on a plane that minute and get out here from Colorado, so we were, my wife and I were very, very excited. I think what makes uh, AU a great place for student athletes is because we allow them to be just that. You know, we, we ensure that they have the opportunity to be great students and be great athletes, that there's not so much pressure on, on the athletic side to, you know, not to be at practice and it doesn't matter if you have class, you're missing it, and to take huge road trips where you're going to have three academic days lost. You know, we, we make sure that we make accommodations to ensure they're able to be students while at the same time providing the resources to allow them to be successful uh, on the court or on the field or wherever they may be competing. So that's what I think is one thing that makes it great to be a student athlete here. And they're not just students at any you know, institution. This is a fantastic academic institution. So they're going to have the best of both worlds. When they leave here, they're going to have the value of, of a, a Division I athletic experience, which I think is tremendously value in character development. And at the same time, have that benefit of having a degree from a you know, world-class institution. I think that, that athletics as a whole, the competition, the, the, the dedication, the, the, the teamwork, the, that indomitable will to win that, that we develop in intercollegiate athletics, I think is huge uh, in helping to develop character in our young men and women here that are, that are athletes, and I think that pays really a huge dividends when they get out in, in, the, in the world as, as citizens, not just in the workplace, but as uh, moms and dads, as husbands, wives, as everything. I think uh, what, what they learn in the athletic arena can be of huge benefit to them later in life.